and with the winds and the rain right. coming down. And they're also telling folks in the Mount Vernon area and really all along the Skagit at this point, if you're in the floodplain, you need to take action right now and you need to protect your home the best you can. And exactly. again, the, the sandbags available at various points and you should go to the uh, Skagit County Department of Emergency Management website. Give them a call. They'll tell you exactly where to go. And if you're in an area that's higher up, stay there today here. And, and this is one reason uh, we had one of the police departments up there uh, along the border with Canada tweet out that they don't want anybody going anywhere here uh, today because uh, things are so dangerous. We have water over the roads up there in Whatcom County. Here's what can happen. Even if it's just six inches, of course, you can hide your plane. And of course, uh, you know, you can start to get a little bit of water into your vehicle if you have a lower car like a minivan or something like that. That's only at six inches deep. Some of this water is a foot deep. And in those cases, uh, it can float many cars. Your car can uh, float away here uh, when it's only a foot deep, especially if that water is moving. And then you get to two feet deep. We're talking SUVs, pickup trucks can be carried away. This is why water over the roads is so, so dangerous.